teen shoots himself while playing with a gun, and it all happened while he was on FaceTime with a friend. Tonight, only Latasha Givens is speaking to the teenager's mother. Latasha? Me coming into the door and him greeting me, um, his goodnight kisses, everything is not. I don't think there's something that I won't miss from him. Anna Rodriguez can hardly breathe as she processes the death of her firstborn and only son, Jair Gonzalez. He holds a very special place in my life, in my heart, simply because around this time, 13 years ago, I was pregnant with Jair. Police say Wednesday evening, the teen and his friend were playing with guns while on a video chat when he was accidentally shot and killed inside their Duluth apartment. It feels like Half my life was taken from me. A huge part of my life has been taken from me. She says her son's friend is now getting death threats as other teens are blaming him for Jair's death. Right now, that friend is not being charged as an adult. We truly believe this was an accident. He is being charged on a juvenile complaint form. Because he tried. He tried to save my baby. He went and knocked on every door in his building. Um, he got a nurse to perform CPR on him. Um, he did everything in his power that he could have done. And to me, that's enough. To me, that's, that's what a best friend should do. Jair was an eighth grader at Duluth Middle School. These are some of the pictures and video his classmates are sending to his mom. He's very funny, oh, very energetic. He was a whole vibe. If you ever was having a bad day, like Jair would lighten it up. I love that my baby was able to impact lives and classmates held a memorial inside the apartment complex where J.A. lives with his family. You can find pictures on our website and Duluth Middle School brought in grief counselors today for any student who wanted to talk about this tragedy. Truth be told, tragedies like this are not uncommon in Georgia. The GBI told us it has been asked to investigate 42 deaths, 42 deaths involving children and guns this year alone. And because agencies aren't required to report the deaths to the GBI, there are even more deaths they believe beyond that number. It is a